Hi, it's me, Bamp, and today we are going to have a discussion. Discussion? Discussion! I know what you're thinking. Hey, Bamp, we have discussions quite a bit lately. What happened to the reviews? What happened to the how-tos? Don't worry, I'm getting to the how-tos. I'm getting to the reviews. But something was on my mind, or rather is on my mind, and I want to know your guys' opinion. Okay, so I was streaming last night. Um, link in the description below. Twitch.tv slash BAMP6X6X6X. Anyway, I was streaming, and what had happened was I went into a mission, and... I wanted to stay 20 minutes at least. I play public a lot. So I at least wanted to stay 20 minutes. I kept getting like 10 minutes, 5 minutes, people saying. And these were relic missions. You know, relic missions that you actually get um, stuff from. So it's not like... It would have been optimal for me to go in solo. I mean, I could have, but it wouldn't have been very optimal. So, um, actually, what's going in the background is me doing a mission from last night. And I'll be perfectly honest, it's not a good example. Because that time, people did stay a bunch of time. But that's only because there was a Nightwave mission that said complete 30 minutes of the Bible, and we just happened to be there. My question to you guys, I guess, is this. Have you noted people only staying in endless missions 5 or 10 minutes? Are you one of those that stay 5 or 10 minutes? I'm not judging or anything. I just really want to know the reason behind it. Is there like not good rewards in Warframe? So it's not worth it to go? Do you like have everything? Um, is matchmaking um, not really all that great? So it's matching everyone up with newer players who don't want to stay for a long time because they're worried that they will lose their progress and their stuff, definitely let me know what you think. What this is about. Now, I'll be honest, this isn't a very, very long discussion video, nor is it going to be long. I honestly just want to know your guys' opinion. I think there's an airplane flying overhead. I don't know if you guys can hear it. But I want to know your guys' legit opinion about this. Because like I said, I was streaming. Again, link in the description below. And this came up multiple times. Not just survival. Later on, after what happened in the event of the footage in the background, I tried to go to uh, defense. Same thing, people only stayed for five waves. I tried to go, then proceed to an excavation. People stayed for a little longer excavation, but I think that's only because they were searching for relics for the latest Prime, you know, Atlas Prime. Um, then with Deception, it seemed like people were only staying at Deception for those Axie relics. And I get maybe the Lua Lens. We're actually, we'll do a separate video on the Lua Lens. I actually have a bit to talk about there. The Lua Lens. But yeah, I digress. That for another time. I know this had turned into like a discussion thing. I hope you guys don't mind all the discussion videos. I just have a lot to say about things. I, and I want to know people's opinions as well. 
as you guys know, I am a Warframe partner. I may not be the biggest partner in the world, but I still do have some connection to, you know, DE and some of the Warframe community and whatnot. And as part of the community, I want to know what has changed, what has made it go from people wanting to stay like 40, 50 minutes. When I first joined Warframe, I immediately started freaking out because I got paired with a group that stayed, wanted to stay for a long time. We ended up saving for 50 minutes, almost an hour. But we ended up leaving because they got tired of me freaking out because it was like the most mods I've ever seen at one time in Wolfram. So I was like, ah, no, we got to go before before it ends, before it goes away, before. <laughs> but yeah, I digress. But let me know what you guys think. Is it the reward factor? Is it not rewarding enough? Are you worried that if you go to... Um, long something might happen are you worried about dying in Warframe and losing the rewards forever are you worried about host migration you know are you worried that someone might leave and then they will host migrate and then you just won't get anything tell me your worries tell me your concerns tell me why tell me if you've had the same experience tell me something and with that, that said, I will hopefully catch you guys in a future video. If you guys liked this video, feel free to hit that like button. Feel free to subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And if you guys want to get notified right when my videos go live, hit that bell icon and you can even punch it if you want. I don't mind. But with that said, I'll catch you guys in the future. Later.